one of the most important tasks of any manager or leader is to create an environment where people feel safe and comfortable to voice opinions, voice concerns, and even ask for help. But that's very difficult to do. So, so going back a little bit, Google did a study on what makes high-performing teams inside their organization. And one of the things they found was that in their highest performing teams, they had what they call psychological safety. People felt comfortable raising their hand and saying, hey, I need help around here, or hey, I, I, I'm, I'm afraid I'm gonna screw this up, or hey, I'm overloaded. And that's really important if you're wanting to create not only a high-performing team, but an environment where you're getting all, all the good ideas and you're not getting uh, feedback that is uncritical. You want some level of critical feedback because that's helpful for us to make better decisions. So how do you do that as a manager and leader? This is where it gets hard. The number one thing you have to do is you have to get comfortable with being vulnerable. That's not easy for managers and leaders. Well, Google told a story of one of their managers that, that built the highest performing teams consistently was suffering with stage four cancer. And he was working on what with one of his teams, a new team he'd been assigned, and the team was pretty good. And at the six month mark, he took him off site and he shared with them about his cancer. And all of a sudden, other team members started sharing what was going on in their lives. And after that off site, the team, some performance shot up because people felt safer and more comfortable to be more real and vulnerable. And that's hard to put yourself out there. But people are going to model the behavior of the leader. So the leader, if you always act like you're perfect or you always have the answer, people aren't gonna feel comfortable being vulnerable, either asking for help or questioning ideas. So you've gotta be able to model that by saying, hey, I need help, or I could really use your ideas or thoughts, and then honor those. And for many of us as managers and leaders, that's a very hard thing. But power and trust lie in that ability to be vulnerable.